Already at the end of the 19th century, scientists discovered the difference between the brains of men and the brains of women. They discovered that the brains of men were, on average, larger than the brains of women. Some scientists took this as evidence to support and explain the then widely held belief that men are smarter than women. In the more than 100 years that have passed, scientists continue to discover differences between the brains of males and females in both humans and animals. For example, compared to men, women have a thicker cortex, a higher proportion of gray matter and a lower proportion of white matter. Compared to women, men have larger ventricles. These big holes you see in the brain. <laughs> I see that some of you that were very happy to discover about the fact that men have bigger brains, then women are not really happy with this discovery. And I can understand this because if you believe, like the scientists from the 19th century, that the size of the, of the brain matters, then indeed you will be embarrassed to discover that your bigger brains come together with a bigger, what shall we call them, empty spaces? <laughs> But I want to convey the message that this is all nonsense. Men do just fine with their larger ventricles. <laughs> just as women do just fine with their smaller brains.